Hello and salut everybody. Question of the day is, how can we keep calm through everything that is going on around us right now? Welcome to my channel, Nick's Quarantine Survival Gear. If you have not subscribed already, I am urging you to please subscribe right now, share this video, like, and also check out the rest of my videos. Thank you very much for your support. So my question of the day, how can we stay calm and why should we stay calm right now through everything that is going on? With everything going on, everyone you talk to nowadays, the news, you know, online, everywhere you go, it is chaos everywhere. The rise in the COVID infection, the rise in COVID death, the wildfire that we are seeing around us, the terror attacks around the world, the, the shutdown of business, the killing around the world, the loss of business, the protest, the loss of business and jobs, the anxiety, the election anxiety, not knowing what is going to happen at the election or after the election, especially not knowing what is going to happen. The grief, the pain, the struggle, the, the rise in poverty, the confusion, the struggle, the chaos around us. How and why should we, do we need, we must keep calm and have peace in our lives right now. I want to tell you that we have to keep calm and have peace in our lives because we are alive for a reason. God is keeping us alive for a reason. We are lucky and privileged to be alive. So we have to find our peace, our calm through all of these stuff that are going on in our lives. And where do we get that? The only guarantee place to find our peace and calm is with God. It is with God. So I want us to look at Matthew 14. We know the story. When Peter asked Jesus to come to him on water, Peter started walking to Jesus on water. But then he started sinking. Why did he start sinking? He started sinking because when the storm got stronger, Peter was fearful. Peter was scared. He'd taken his eyes off Jesus. The fear took over him. So he started sinking. So I want to tell you, I want to tell you that do not let the fear, the anger, the grief, the virus, the death, the chaos around us taking over us. Because, it, because if it does, we will start sinking. We will sink. So I want you to please join me so that we can keep our eyes on God, on Jesus, no matter how hard it is, no matter how strong is the storm, no matter how high is the storm, is the, the, the mountain in front of us, we keep our eyes on Jesus, on God, and never taking them off and never give up. So will you join me? I know, I know for sure if we keep our eyes on Jesus, on God, we will find our hope, our trust, our belief, our faith, our thanksgiving for him, no matter what is going on. So will you join me? Will you join me in keeping our, in reminding our mind and soul and heart and eyes and our family? to keep our focus on God, on Jesus, so that we can find our calm and peace through every single thing that is going on, so that we can take it one day at a time? Will you join me? So that we can weaken the anger, the grief, the pain, the struggle, the virus, the sicknesses, the attacks, the evil, the lost, so that we can weaken them and shame them by focusing our eyes, our mind and soul on God, on Jesus. Will you? Will you join me? Please share this video if you haven't shared already. Like if you do like it. Subscribe if you have not subscribed already. 
and please check out the rest of my videos. Thank you very much. Please stay blessed and safe.